Hi everyone, welcome to my channel Mikla TV and today I'm gonna to teach you one of my secrets on how you can travel around the world at least once every two years for free. Before starting, I want to tell you if you haven't subscribed yet to my channel, just go click on subscribe. I have a bunch of traveling videos and interesting video where I'm teaching people how to improve their life financially, get more money to travel or to spend more time with their family at home. So, so here's a secret. It's only mathematics. It's really simple and I found this by myself. I found this by myself. Nobody taught me that. The more I travel, the more I realized that this thing was working and I applied it and I'm traveling for free once every year or two years. Every year or two now, I get one trip for free. So here's, so here's my tactics. You need to start shopping where you're traveling. The more I started traveling, I realized that the clothing was way less expensive in other countries. Because anyway, we buy our cl the clothing that we buy comes from other countries. So I started shopping over there and I realized I was saving a lot and a lot of money. I've realized that the clothing cost at least 75% less in other countries than in here in Canada. At least, at least. 75%. I made myself a budget and I started calculating how much money I would save if I buy all my clothes while traveling. Let's say I would buy in one year I would buy six shirts for $20. That would be a total of $120. In another, in another country the same shirt would cost me $5 which is $30 which I'm saving $90 just for shirts in one year. Jeans, same thing. Right here, I would say in average, one pair of jeans is about $40. If I buy three pair a year, that's $120. In another country, the same pair of jeans is $10. So if you calculate, I do the difference, I still save $90 right there in one year. Same thing for shoes. Let's say here in Canada, you pay around $60 for a pair of shoes. If you buy two pair of shoes a year, that's $120. Over there, it's at least 75% less. It's about $30 for two pairs of shoes maximum. That's if you're not lucky, you're gonna pay that much. And you save another $90 at least right there. For those of you who wear hats and like hats, you're gonna pay at least $25 here for one hat, which means for two hats, $50, maybe with tax a little bit more. Over there, you're gonna pay $10 for two hats you're saving right here $40 and then we can add hoodies, jackets, dress shirts, watch, as many accessories as you want. I've put here a number of um, $250 at least extra that would cost me here in Canada in one year and which over there I can buy the exact same thing for about $63, $63 which I'm saving $180. And that's all for one year. So if I calculate everything, in one year I save about $588 shopping in another country. So just for you to understand, if I take this $588 times 2, that's, that's $1,176. I can spend at least one week in Cuba, Toto and Cluedo, pay my trip to Havana and buy my clothes right there. That pays my trip to Havana, I get a free tour of the capital city, I get to buy my clothes and I come back and I was in Cuba for one week. Can you imagine that? That's amazing. With the same amount of money I can go to Costa Rica, I can go to Panama, Colombia, depending on the time of the year, Jamaica. If you go to Asia, you're gonna get the deals are gonna be way better and you're gonna save even more money if you go to Asia. Well, that's my way of helping others and it helps me at the same time to travel for free. It's a really good trick. So next time that you're in a mall and you think of buying a shirt or something, do not buy it. Don't try to buy any clothes for at least one or two years. And with all the money you save, travel and then buy it over there. And you're gonna see, it's worth it. Save your money, Travel the world 
have fun. As I said earlier in the video, don't forget to subscribe, watch my traveling videos here, and my other brain coding video right there, and we'll see you soon. Take care.